Legend has it the Eastern Hellbender slithered here straight from hell. They're known among locals in Appalachia as Mud Devils, Snot Otters, or Grampus, among other nicknames. And they can reach up to about two feet in length and weigh in at more than three pounds. But in actuality, hellbenders are sensitive creatures. Although they've been around for at least 160 million years, Hellbenders breathe almost exclusively through their skin, so they need excellent water quality to survive. But many rivers across the U.S. are becoming increasingly polluted or destroyed, and the Trump administration is cutting grants and conservation efforts meant to protect rivers and species like the Hellbender. Last year, officials proposed listing the Eastern Hellbender as endangered under federal law, meaning they're at risk of extinction. But if hellbenders disappear, that's not just bad for them, that's bad for us too. Because hellbenders are so sensitive, they serve as something of a canary in the coal mine for the health of streams across the U.S. And that's something we sorely need. To hear more from researchers on the front lines of trying to conserve the hellbender and our ecosystems, read my news story, Anatomy of an Extinction, at motherjones.com.